Welcome back. Um, today we have this problem. It's called remove uh, duplicates from sorted array. Uh, given an integral array nums sorted in uh, non-decreasing uh, order, remove the duplicates in place such that each unique element appears only once. The relative order of the elements should be keep the same. This is quite important. So we have this is the second requirement and this is the first requirement. Then return the number of the unique elements in the nums. Okay. So we, we should do three things. First, we uh, we remove all the duplicates. The second, make sure that the the, um, uh, the 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 relative order of the elements should keep the same. So it it, it should be sorted. And we should consider the number of the unique elements of nums uh, to be k. To get accepted, you need to uh, do the following. Change the array nums such that the first k elements of nums contain the unique elements in the order they were present in nums initially. The remaining elements of nums are not important as well as the size of nums. Okay. So let's just try to go gather all the requirements because 50% of 6 or 60% of under of, of solving the problem is to just to understand the requirements we have the three things that we have to do we have an array that we want to remove all duplicates okay and we want to keep the order the same and we want to return the length of the unique uh, elements of nums we want to make sure that we put the nums we will swap so we put the the unique in the first we don't care about the 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 last element and that's it so let's just take this an example and let's see how we can solve this problem oh sorry okay so let's take the pen and let's try to solve let's say that we have um what was the okay oops again 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 mm -hmm. okay so let's say that we want to remove all duplicates characters so one of the things that we could just loop first for each character and after that, try to loop against all the characters against it in the in, in the in the in um, in the array. And whenever we found um, we we found um, uh, uh, a duplication, we delete one. Okay, and we do this for each one for each element. And I guess this one is like looping twice. It will be o of n uh, squared and it's not that efficient it will work but it's not efficient so what should we do that we could create um for example we could create a pointer let's call it a pointer and in this pointer this pointer basically will be the uh, the, um, the insert index where should we swap or sh where should we delete so it will be zero for example no, 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 let's make it one because we just, I, I will tell you why one. And let's make one. And I will say something because it's a sorted array. We don't need, we know, we don't need to have to make two loops in each other. So basically I could just start here from one. Okay. And compare it to the previous. If they are equal each other. Okay. For example, I have here pointer. It's equal uh, one. And I have, um, I have, uh, just one minute. Yep. I have this pointer and this pointer, let's call it counter because I guess counter it's maybe more, represent more what the pointer is. I will say counter. And this is what we're going to return. So it will be one for now. And what I'm going to say that if I equals doesn't equals uh, the previous one, okay, um, this uh, 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 nums of of um, of uh, of the 
like the nums of the the counter nums of of index counter will equal the nums of i because they equals each other we don't do anything we continue okay so counter right now equals uh, one and right now i will be i will be here so i will be i will be two and I, I i put i will be two because i'm always uh, compared to the previous so i can't make i zero and compare it to the previous because there is no previous so i will be one and for the second iteration i right now equals two let me delete that so for the second iteration i right now equals 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 um uh, i equals two and the element let's just have something called lm the lm will equals nums of i so lm it will be equals one so right now i'm saying that does element this one equals its previous okay it doesn't equals its previous so what should we do we should we should say that nums of insert index or nums of counter nums of counter this counter nums of counter one and nums of counter is zero will equals nums of i which is element which is one so this one we delete this one and it will equals one okay so let's continue looping and we increase counter by one so counter by one will equals two okay so right now i will equals three let just i will equals three and element will equals one because we are here and i'm saying that if i of element doesn't equals the previous it's equal so ju just continue just increasing i i will equals four and we are here it doesn't equals it's equals okay continue so i equals five so we are here so elements equals two right now because i equals five so i'm saying that if if this element doesn't equals its previous which is one yeah it doesn't equal so first of all let's increase counter by one no no before increasing counter we will update uh, this element uh, uh, nums of counter will equals nums of uh, i would equals element so this one we delete this one and it will equals two so zero one two okay and we will increase this by one counter will be three let me clean this up okay this will be two and counter will be three and right now element uh, i it will be six let me delete this i will be six and element will be one two three four element will be two so i'm saying that if this one doesn't equal this previous it's equal so okay doesn't do anything just to continue executing so i will equal seven and element will equal three because we continue looping so it will be seven and element will equal three okay so does this one equals its previous no so what should we do we if update the nums of counter which is this one and make it equals to nums of i which is this element so it will be three and we can do this by one it will be four okay and let's continue let me delete this okay so i will say right now uh, i i it's equal eight and right now i guess we are here and element will be three so i'm saying that 
does this equals previous um does it equals previous y no it's equal so okay continue so uh, i will equals 9 let me delete this an element will equals 4 and i'm saying that this one equals its previous no so increase counter so counter increase uh, before increase counter uh, uh, nums of i four this nums of counter which is this one which will be equals nums of i which will be four and increase the counter by one it will be five and uh, this is the way that we can solve it and it's just the problem that it's easy problem it's really easy problem but we you just under try to understand why uh, this is happening and so let's go to the code so you you will get um you will get better so let's just say that we let counter equals one okay and i will say four let i equals one i um less than nums the length okay and i plus plus and i will say if nums of we said that we want to make sure if it doesn't equals its previous so if if nums doesn't of nums of i my uh, uh, nums of i minus one doesn't equals nums of i if they doesn't equals each other we said that nums of counter okay will equals nums of i and counter plus plus and we return counter it's really easy problem but you just have to understand why we're doing that and we just have to go through go walk through this this solution so it's really easy problem but just uh, it's only four lines of code what no thanks so um that's it the way that we solve this problem um you could just make sure that you didn't miss the 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 the, 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 the board so you understand wh why why we we, d we went with this solution and why this solution is better this solution i guess it's the same complexity f of o of n because we have uh, we only loop one we don't loop twice so it's it's a pretty uh good solution i guess it's the same complexity is it's really good and um yeah that's it for this video and hope my, my 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 description was quite good if you like my 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 content make sure to subscribe and hit the notification bell so you'll never miss a video and give me a thumbs up if you if you thought my solution is not that good just give me a comment and tell me what the thing that you think that i should improve and uh, and maybe if you have a better solution feel free to give to put in a comment um, when we like share the link of uh, with us of about uh, lead code and yeah that's it for this video and see you in future problems